Can we go live? Yeah. We're sick. Yes. All right. I now call to order the Leander Independent School District Board of Trustees, March 19th, 2020, emergency meeting. Even though students and staff remain apart, we can still come together to do great things for kids. Our Board of Trustees did just that, coming together virtually from their homes to approve paying teachers and employees during the COVID-19 global pandemic. In an emergency meeting on March 19th, the Board approved a resolution to pay employees during the closure and to compensate essential hourly employees with premium pay. Even with our facilities closed until April 5th, we are still working to serve students. Listen to Board President Trish Bodie and Superintendent Bruce Gearing talk about the meeting and the work continuing to support schools in Leander ISD. It's a very um, unusual time with what happens day to day it seems like there's always something new in the news so to be able to offer some stability or something that is consistent we had a fantastic board meeting tonight unprecedented brand new via zoom never done that before in my life i have to say i think what is critical is that the board tonight in a voice of solidarity solidarity and in a unanimous motion uh, said to Dr. Gehring in the district that we want you to be able to continue to not have unnecessary hurdles as we're working day to day through this crisis. But as we discussed, we want to try to maintain where we can that um, that link to the board to make sure we're we're hearing from the community when we can. We're doing the vote. We're asking the board seven different voices of how we're going to move forward through this crisis. I, I really appreciate the leadership of the board in this in this uh, allowing us to um, you know call the suspension of classes in this manner, but also allowing us the authority through that resolution that the board passed tonight. In case of dire emergency, we now have the ability to keep managing the school district and 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 running effectively and efficiently over the next several weeks as this crisis unrolls. Um, it was undoubtedly a very difficult decision to suspend our normal school activities. And we know part of the reason that was such a difficult decision is we know that this really deeply affects our families in our community. And we want them to know that we're doing everything in our power to meet their needs. Um, but should they have additional needs that are not being met, we really are urging them to reach out to us and we will do everything in our power to make sure um, that they stay safe and well during these very trying times. Some of y'all took your spring break to start the process planning to get into place to get ready for next week. Um, that is so deeply appreciated by the community. But these are unprecedented times and this is a, a very serious situation and I just sincerely appreciate how uh, seriously the board is taking this and how seriously our administrative team is taking the fact that we've suspended normal operations in our school district and yet our uh, every team is working hard to make sure that our kids get fed, that their mental wellness is taken care of, that um, we have an instructional plan going into place in both the short term and the long term uh, and that we're taking care of as many needs as we can. For more information from Leander ISD and our response to the COVID-19 global pandemic, please visit leanderisd.org slash COVID-19.